This is Bobby Snoo from Channel 262. We're going to get straight to your late night weather report with brothers Teddy and Eddie Mercury. Guys. And our cold front is coming from the Arctic region up here, and there's going to be a polar vortex kind of pushing its way down south. So I would expect maybe some heavy snowfall, maybe late tomorrow morning. Uh, what else? Some, some things. Let's get over here. No, okay. well, I was just explaining the polar <clears throat> vortex. Well, okay. Probably going to be some. Welcome back to our late snow. night uh, weather report with. Eddie and Teddy Mercury. Uh, Bobby had that wrong earlier when he said Teddy and Eddie. It's Eddie and Teddy Mercury. I did go to school for this for six years. So, no, uh, who lowered... Okay. okay. It's not real, it's not real science. This? So, so. Not real science? Yeah. It's, okay. All right, yeah. It's okay. kind of... A little jab there. Okay, I got it. What were you reporting? This is not even the correct screen. Who, who loaded the screen up? <clears throat> Can we go back to the one I had programmed? This is Did you right. change this? This is all right. This is what you just... Is this what you're... Oh, yeah, yeah. No, this one's... This one is correct. Uh, yep, there's some snow coming from up there. Seems right. Uh, okay, no, this is the right one. Okay. All right, so now what we've got here is a tropical storm, which is actually causing some warm air to move forward. It's moving north, and we're going to get a little bit of a warm front here in the next couple days. Expect to that temperature to rise, and make sure that your air conditioners are primed and ready. Folks, I, I don't know. This doesn't look, doesn't look right. I don't even know what uh, is this. Okay, well, like I was saying, the warm front is going to be moving in. Continental now, US. what's this going to do for the rest of the week? The projection is that it will move east. We do, are going to have an eastbound wind that will move yeah, that warm front gonna, out. It'll move that warm front over there towards Teddy. It's going to move east. Maybe it'll, it'll down move this that way. warm front over towards Teddy and maybe clear out his brain a little bit, get a little bit of that moisture well, out of Well, I think head. some of the snow from up, up north is going to be coming down as that kind of sweeps underneath. Uh, well, it is south. July. Don't expect this, snow coming from the north. It well, is. Well, what do you think? Oh, look it at all is this mid pressure. July. There's not going to be any. There's a lot of there's pressure. Not gonna be any, there's a lot of pressure up here. Yeah, there's a lot it's of pressure in here right now. This is not okay. It is not going to be snowing. It's July. Why would you report that it's going to snow in July? It never. It's, it hasn't snowed in July. I don't think ever in this region. Okay. Well, look at the radar, <sighm> folks. Just look at it yourself, and you know. Yeah, well, who loaded this? Because that's the wrong graphic for it. Well, that's a radar, so. Okay, you like to rip me a little bit. I understand, Teddy. We've done this for a little back and forth our, our whole lives. So, like I was saying, the North, sixty thousand dollars have a little for your can Somebody, please take him out of here. This not is not. Folks, you can Google this information. It's online. Uh, you can look for yourselves. You don't and need don't to listen Google to online man. because that is not going to be an accurate report. I'm a meteorologist. I do this for a living. Please, somebody take Teddy out of here, Teddy. <sighs> How, how much did you spend on it? It's like six. Okay, so now what we're going to do, we're going to start reporting this false, crazy it's weather patterns. It's not false. It's, it's a lot of We're people just going to re start reporting things. This is okay for you. This is okay for you, huh, Brian? It's Bobby. No, Brian, the, the producer. I know. He doesn't even know your name. We're back uh, on channel 262. This is Bobby Snoo. Uh, we're going to cut back uh, to the weather with Teddy and Eddie Mercury. All right. Thank you, Bobby, for taking that away. We are back now with Eddie and Teddy Mercury. I'm Eddie. And I'm Teddy. We've kind of resolved uh, our differences over the break a little bit. We're going to get back to you with an accurate weather report this time, yeah. and we're going to take it from the top. Um, let's go ahead and take a look at what we've got on the radar today. Now, we got this warm uh, section coming from the south. It's going to Which I was this... saying is the warm front coming in. It's going to well, be a little warm air. The temperature's going to so, rise from the south. This, this high pressure. And then we're going to have it push you got this purple uh, indicator up here that usually indicates cold weather purple, purple south. It's red. You are, besides a bad reporter and a bad meteorologist, in fact, not a meteorologist, you are colorblind. Nope. And I've never failed a colorblind test in my life. I've taken and over 40 colorblind okay. tests and I've passed Yeah, okay, online. You Just like you've gotten Google, your weather reports. Uh, okay, you so Google now what I, what I had done, Teddy, is while not during the break, I had Samantha, Samantha the intern, um, just print off some just some glossary terms. And while we're live on the air here, I'd like to go over some and just see what you know. Let's just oh, yeah, test your accuracy. Good. Folks, this you know? is a good test for you at home. Oh, yeah, okay. Um, what's a blocking high, Teddy? What's blocking high? Okay, yeah, okay. So let's go back here. Let's see. Cold what? air funnel. What's a cold air funnel? That's like a uh, tornado, but I believe. It is not. Okay, so let's go now. Um, cold I got air one here funnel. for you. It's a, just climate. What's climate, Teddy? Climate is... Okay, uh, I think you get my point. What we get coming from the north that's moving down south is dropping a lot of uh, 
cold temperatures and snow. Okay. Well, wh uh, while precipitation and the climate or the what's cold dew climate. Point? What's dew point? That's they, a, uh, they make cars. Yeah. Okay. While you Everyone were hot riding that. around, they don't make cars, actually. And while you were hot riding around in your car, I was studying school. I was studying to be a meteorologist, no, you which didn't I didn't get that good of a grade. So. I did. Okay. One semester. One semester, I had one bad grade. I had yeah. a hard time. It was a personal thing. Meteorology 101. It was meteor. It was. It was an intro level. You know what? It doesn't matter. Okay. That was a, a tough personal point. Let's get back to the report here. Okay. So now what we had. Uh, you know what? $60,000. Down the funnel, cold funnel. Okay, it wasn't sixty thousand dollars because it was one class, and yes, I had to retake an extra semester. Okay, you know what? That's that's. No. Beside well, we can talk about what's on the map here. <laughs> as I was saying, this. Uh, yeah, go ahead. Red, well, kind of red purpley uh, climate up here is actually the cold air moving down south, and it's going to drop some blizzards and some snow. If you're in this area, folks, I'd I'd suggest maybe maybe moving farther south towards Florida or Georgia. Anything you want to add to that? Okay. Moving south would be a bad idea at this point because it is a really warm outside and going south is only going to get a little warmer because we've got the warm front coming up from the south going north. We've got a uh, nice western wind that's pushing eastward. It's going to move that and and it's going to, you know what? Maybe we should cut to the outside camera. How about I'll tell the directions. We'll cut to the outside camera. Right and now. cut to the outside camera. Okay, well. Wait. This is Tornado Tom out in the field. And today we're looking at if it's forecasting if there's a uh, rope you've got and you might look outside and if it's wet then it's probably raining and if it's you can't find it it might be snowing you know it might be snow on the ground but get your uh, snowboard and skis ready because this is middle of summer and you never know in Missouri what's gonna happen I don't know 